Did you know that 90% of Americans spend their time indoors? Well, in today's video, I'm going to tell you the 5 benefits of what you can get for being outdoors and make sure you stay to the end of this video where I'll be talking about this last benefit which will help you the most. So without further ado, let's go on to the first benefit which is going to be getting that vitamin D from the sunlight. And the reason why this is super important is because a lot of Americans today where we have a big deficiency in vitamin D and the reason for that is because we're always stuck indoors, we're indoors working all the time, we're indoors after we want to get home to relax and we don't really spend the time to go out and soak up that sunlight for 20 minutes in a day. So one, one of the things of being outdoors is you get to soak up the vitamin D, you get to, because our body gets to convert that sunlight, the direct sunlight that we have onto our skin, into chemicals that make it into chem vitamin D. And to get an adequate amount of vitamin D, what we have to do is every single day, we need to get at least 20 minutes being outdoors and getting some of that sunlight. So when you go outdoors and getting that sunlight, you could get, go through a morning walk, you could get it from walking out from work and go on a little stroll right there. You could also go eat outdoors at lunchtime and just be in the sun, get that direct sunlight so your body will be able to convert that sunlight into chemicals for to become vitamin D. So that's the first benefit of being outdoors. So the second benefit that you can get for being outdoors is to breathe better air. And the reason why you actually breathe better air outdoors compared to indoors is because for indoors, there's actually indoor pollution. And that could be from various things in your household. That could be inadequate ventilation. That could be mold. That could be the paint in your house. That could be the chemicals from your household or personal items that you have in your house. There's a whole bunch of different things. And there was a research source from the Science of Total Environment that ranked house pollution, all the stuff indoors, as the ninth largest burden of risk that's pretty big right there so what you want to do is with all that, that indoor pollution it's 10 times worse than outdoors you want to get out some get outdoors get some of that fresh air get some of that sunlight and really just enjoy the nature or, or enjoy your outdoor surroundings and just be more present so that's the second benefit so the third benefit of being outdoors is that it's going to ease anxiety because have you ever been outside or go on a walk, walking through nature and you just feel so calm, you feel relaxed, and you just aren't really overthinking about everything, you're just being in the moment, just relaxing, seeing all the trees or seeing your surroundings, looking how everything looks so nice. And there was research published in 2017 by the Frontiers in Psychology that says that being outdoors can actually help with your overall being and help reduce anxiety. So from this article, being outdoors actually helps calm yourself down and you just be more present with everything that you see around yourself and you don't really have this over way of think, overthinking everything and just like, oh my god, what's gonna happen? What's gonna happen? What's gonna happen? So just being outdoors will help reduce and ease anxiety. And another thing that being outdoors will help you with along with ease anxiety is that it helps get your creative juices going. So that's why people have meetings or walking meetings outdoors now. They're just chatting, talking outside just so they could get the creative juice and think of new ideas on what they could do for their business or for themselves or any other parts of their lives. So that's the third benefit is that it eases anxiety. So the fourth benefit that you can get for being outdoors is that you actually help improve your body. And what I mean by improving your body is that when you're in nature and you're just walking around enjoying whatever you're seeing, it actually helps improve your white blood cells that helps fight your infections and diseases. And also it actually helps lower your blood pressure. And the last benefit of being outdoors is that you actually get to practice your grounding. And what grounding is, is that what is us human beings, that's having our feet touch the earth directly and we actually exchange electrical charges so with that when we exchange and have electrical charges flow through us it actually helps improve our sleep quality and also reduces inflammation with us and also you may feel more relaxed for example if you were at a beach and you're walking barefooted and you were, your feet was in the sand for a long period of time you may feel more at ease more relaxed and you just feel really calm and that's an example of grounding and for us human beings we don't really do a lot of grounding now since we're always wearing shoes so things that are not conductive 
So what you want to do to actually get more benefit of it is practice your grounding so it will help improve your sleep quality and also reduce inflammation. So those are the five benefits that you can get for being outdoors and if you like this video give this video a thumbs up and click the subscribe button down below and if you have no any ways of being or having benefits of being outdoors let me know in the comments box below and i'll see you guys on the next video peace